Hello everyone, I'm Zhu Zhenzhang from Galbot. I'm Yun Liu. We envision a future that humanoid robots can work for us in every household. They take on your daily chores and can free up your time. A primary technical challenge is to give this robot a human-sized workspace. Most existing humanoid teleoperation systems focus mainly on the upper body. If a robot can only stand straight, its workspace is extremely <coughs> limited. Allowing it to squat and lean forward would expand its workspace dramatically, making many more tasks possible. The core challenge is learning to maintain dynamic balance in various environments as the robot's center of mass shifts in a large space. Today, we are unveiling OpenWBT, the world's first open source humanoid whole body VR teleoperation system adapted to various robot types under both real and simulation environments. Even beginners can build a humanoid whole body teleoperation system within hours. The system adapts effortlessly to different environments, terrains, and tasks. And it works in both simulation and the real world. All you need is a laptop and a VR headset. With its plug and play setup, you can get the rich teleoperation data in hours instead of months, jumping starting the training of next generation body AI models. The system's robustness is powered by our latest R2S2 whole body control technology. We address the problem with a novel hierarchical design. At the low level, we design a simple real transferable primitive skill library. Then, we unnumble those skills into a unified neural latent skill space to enable coordination between different body paths and transition between different skills. Our system runs not only on the 29 DOFs Unitree G1, but also transfers to the adult height Unitree H1. Since the Unitree H1 robot is larger and heavier, its stability margin is much smaller and its dynamics is more strongly coupled. To foster an open, collaborative humanoid ecosystem, we have fully open sourced OpenWBT and will keep updating and expanding it. We invite developers, researchers and robotics enthusiasts worldwide to test and use the system, share feedback, and help foster the development of general-purpose humanoid robot technology.